Alright, so we're continuing on with the main mission now. We actually went back to Oberlin and picked up Piper because I felt that we've built a strong enough affinity with Paladin Dance that we should move on to another character. And this is the journey of the uh, Freedom Trail. I guess we keep following this red line. I didn't know where to go, so I actually just looked it up. So the seven indicates that's the seven le letter in the puzzle, and it's part of the trail word. So your best bet is just to keep just writing this all down. I stayed in my power armor because someone told me that there's actually going to be a lot of mutants along the way here if you haven't cleared out this area already. So we're gonna do that. Apparently this trail is something that's actually real in Boston. So that's the fourth letter. It's in the word trail. Keep following the red line here. Finally here. Oh my god. There's so many mutants along the way. Old Church North. <laughs> Fools. Fools everywhere. and we'll go to where the picture of the lantern is. Real shame to see a place like this neglected. You guys like my glow stick? Don't have legs though, do ya now, bitch? Wow. <laughs> Headshot. Oh my god, how is this? You're telling me. Something's behind you right now. So we have the R in freedom. Press. Oh, so it starts with R? The A in trail. A and trail. The I and trail. 
Man, it's hard to see if it lines up correctly. It's like right in the middle of everything. <laughs> Allen Trail. Okay. The Arn Trail. The O in Freedom. A in trail. I'll put this in the description if any guys actually want to use this of what the combination is. And then the D and freedom. Huzzah! Jesus Christ. You went through a lot of effort to arrange this meeting. But before we go any further, answer my questions. Who the hell are you? Why don't you tell me who you are first? In a world full of suspicion, treachery, and hunters, we're the Simps' only friends. We're the railroad. So answer my question. I followed the Freedom Trail looking for the railroad. I'm not your enemy. If that's true, you have nothing to fear. Who told you how to contact us? I don't want to get anyone into trouble. We'll find out, one way or another. Last question. Why are you here? I tracked down and killed a courser at Green Tech Genetics. Now I need help breaking the code on his courser chip. You have what? This is not a joking matter. I didn't know we were having a party. What gives with my invitation? Oh, I see you invited the courser killer. Nice. Deacon, you're late. You're saying this intruder actually killed a courser? Single-handedly? <laughs> oh. That'd give even Gloria a run for her money. Newsflash, boss. This guy is kind of a big deal. If you're done interrogating him, you might want to show this coarser murdering machine a little courtesy. Hmm? Just a thought. I owe you an apology. Anyone who kills a coarser is good in my book. I'm Desdemona, and I'm the leader of the railroad. Who are you people exactly? In a world full of suspicion, treachery, you already and said hunters, that. We're the synth's only friend. Des, we need to let him in. He's got an intact courser chip, for God's sake. That violates our security protocols. To hell with that. He killed a courser. There's no way he's working for the Institute. We're letting you into our headquarters. You're the first outsider ever to be given this privilege. We'll discuss the details about your chip inside. Jesus. I gotta change that light. I thought it would be cool at first, but that's kind of annoying. I think I think I'll go with the nice blue tint. Why is there green radioactive goo everywhere? What's wrong with you people? Come on, one at a time now. There you go. Stealing. Yes, it is. For now. Hey, dude. You need something? Tom, our visitor here has a courser chip. Whoa! For real? Oh, man, it's been ages. Right. Some ground rules. Tom can get you the code, but once he's done, we get the courser chip. 
Why do you want the Courser chip? Institute tech is light years beyond what we have. And a Courser chip is top of the line. I'm not going to get into details, but that chip could help us save lives. Maybe throw a wrench in some of the Institute's operations. So, hand over the chip. Fine. It's yours. All right. Tom, make it happen. All right, little Courser chip. Let's have the circuit analyzer take a crack at you. What happens if you toss that? Is it even possible to toss like a key item like that? Because it's kind of just sitting in our inventory. Let me know in the comment boxes. Chip accessed. Just poke the analog connectors a little. What? Oh man, don't, don't, don't crash. Hold it together. Memory here go. Here it comes. Encryption algorithms. All right. All right, I'm still running. Oh man. They've added more decimals to the last cipher. This is gonna be... Come on, baby. Show me that pattern. Where is it? Wait. They're using the same logarithmic function as the key generator. Oh, man, we got lucky. I got you, you institute bastard. I got you. Soft for you. Come on. Show me that sweet face. Come on, baby. Then we got it. We got the code. <laughs> Let me load that onto the hollow tape for ya. Good work, Tom. Yeah, but I'm not sure our luck will hold up next time, Des. Start working on the rest of the chip. And you, I'd love to work with you more. Let me know if you're interested. But to be crystal clear, if you use that data and discover anything involving the Institute, you share it with us first. Otherwise, our relationship will be in jeopardy. You gotta be careful, man. The Institute is everywhere. Dang. If we're going to be dealing more with each other, I need to make sure that we're on the same page. You know what a synth is, right? I've heard rumors. What are they, really? The Institute created them. Synthetic humans. They're mostly organic, part machine. Somewhere along the line, they became more than just constructs. They think, they feel, and they act just like you and me. The Institute treats synths as property, as tools. Why does the Institute treat them that way? They're playing God, tinkering with things they don't fully understand. From that lofty vantage, it's easy to deny their creation's very humanity. That sounds like slavery. Exactly. So we seek to free the synths from their bondage, give them a chance at a real life. I have a question, the only question that matters. Would you risk your life for your fellow man? Even if that man is a synth? Once, I pledged my life to protect my countrymen. I don't see this as any different. Well said. Someone with your skills, your beliefs. Normally, we'd try and recruit you. But right now, we don't have the time to train up a new agent. There are, however, other valuable ways you can contribute. And in turn, we can help you. See Deacon for details. You're free to go. So close. Are you Deacon? You're Deacon. No, that's not Deacon. I don't have anything to say. Oh, Rowan Agent. These guys do not like me. Oh, they'll point me in the way, Deacon. Oh, Deacon was the Elvis looking guy, right? Right. Always on good behavior, aren't you? Yes, I am, ma'am. Come here again if you need to meet us. We'll know you're coming. Hope you didn't mind the reception. When you tango with the Institute, you gotta be careful when someone new gets on the dance floor. Your leader was just being cautious. I'll take hurt feelings over becoming the Institute's plaything any day. Exactly. Kind of killed our chance at a friendly first impression, though. But it's all good now. I vouched for you. Nobody got shot. Still, I would consider it a close personal favor if you didn't sell us out to the Institute. Thanks. So tell me, why did you vouch for me? In our little outfit, it's my job to know things. And with everything you've done, it's clear you're capable. A dangerous enemy. And I'm betting a valuable ally. But why the trust? You can't be taking it all on faith. I don't know if we can trust you, but I hope we can. 
We just survived a hell of a crisis, so we may just be a teeny weeny bit desperate for new members. If everything was sunshine and bottle caps, we'd probably play a longer getting to know you game, but we don't have that luxury. Really? Is that all? You just don't give up. All right, I have a short list of people I think would be a good fit for our family. You piqued my interest, so maybe I asked around, did my homework. If you hadn't found us, there's a chance I would have found you instead. Thanks for saving me the trip. So Dez wants me to make you a tourist. That's what we call someone who helps out with the odd job here and there. What a waste. I'm just gonna come out and say this. The railroad needs you. You sure you need me? Desdemona didn't seem to care. She's just thinking of the time and manpower it would take to train you. And if you were some hick from the burbs that didn't know your ass from a rocket launcher, she'd be right. But I'm betting someone like you just needs a few pointers. And a target. You got my attention. I got a job. Too big for me, just perfect for the two of us. You help me out, we turn a few heads, and then Dez invites you into the fold. Then, if you get into a bind and need some help, your buddies in the railroad got your back. What's the job? So, up front, the only thing I'll say is that it's gonna be a wild and dangerous ride, but probably nothing new for someone like you. Sign me up, then. Perfecto. Let's meet up at the old freeway outside of Lexington. I'll fill you in once you get there. Always on good behavior, aren't you? Yes, ma'am. Please let me tra fast travel from here. Always on good behavior, aren't you? Okay, you need to get new material. You've said that like 20 times now. <laughs> Screw it. Screw the whales. We sprint there. Nuke the whales! Oh, it's those deer with like 20 heads. I'm assuming they won't get it. They won't attack unless provoked, correct? That's what the bio on the screen said. You know what mod I'm really waiting for? I'm waiting for the it's always daytime mod. Because it's so much easier to see stuff. Really, dude? One. Why was he traveling alone? I want a better hey. scope for this gun. Deacon, is that you? Like the disguise? It's Wastelander Camo. This is my pile of garbage, asshole. Back off. Good, right? <laughs> You're lucky I didn't do one of my face swaps, too. You can change your face? I put myself under the knife every year or two. New face, new body, you know, the full makeover. It keeps our enemies guessing. I almost didn't recognize you. That's the point. So, about the job. The railroad's only recently been using the old North Church. Our old base was underneath the Slocum's Joe. We had a pretty sweet setup until the Institute found us. Your base was under a donut shop? It's a lot better than it sounds. Well, it was, until it was blown to hell. What happened? Our HQ was strong, defensible. Heck, we thought it was secure. Inside a minute, the Institute troopers breached the doors and turned it into a shooting gallery. The survivors didn't have time to grab anything. So we're getting something important we had to leave behind. What exactly are we looking for? I'll tell you when we get inside. I know that's a bum deal, but strategic ignorance has saved our organization more times than I can count. We got a tourist nearby. He or she has information on the base. So let's pump him for information before we dive in. For now, I'll take point. So I'm looking for rail signs, symbols we use to send messages to each other. If you like that, we got signs and counter signs, dead drops, and even a secret handshake. All right, maybe the handshake never got on. 
Anyway, the tourists should have a trail left for us. Here we go. Rail sign. The arrow in the center indicates a direction. So our tourist is up ahead. Let's keep going. I'm gonna bet dollars to donuts that Deacon's a synth. And he's dead. Right there. Ooh, car. Nice. Give me that. Come on, Piper. Damn, those guys move fast. Hooray! For science, where are you? Oh, there you are. Gotta build some sweet guns next time I get back to the Prid one. I can and pretty much do probably close. the majority of the gun mods now, just lacking material. Nuka Cola. I can carry something if you need me to. I wouldn't not do that to a lady. I'm a gentleman. You just hang tight to that gun of yours. See the plus in the center? That means there's an ally nearby. Our tourist, you take point on the conversation. Look, no matter what he says, you just say, mine is in the shop. Trust me. Mine is in the shop? Looks like he was slaying ghouls. counter do you have a goddamn Geiger counter mine is in the shop who the hell is he HQ said they were sending one agent not two sorry I'm new he's just showing me the ropes all right the wall is my witness I thought I was dead it's about goddamn time you headquarters bastards got here are you in danger I signed on for light recon but that little slocum's jaw of yours is crawling with goddamn chrome dumb synth sons of bitches! <sighs> if I haven't been made yet, I'll be spotted when I leave here. I'm goddamn trapped. The front's fortified to hell and back. They place mines all over the goddamn place. They have a minefield? Yeah, the mother of all minefields. I couldn't draw you a map if I tried. I appreciate all you've done. I hope it helps. I really do. As soon as it's safe, I'm getting the hell out of here. So if you need anything else, better ask soon. Excuse me. Well, isn't Ricky just a ray of sunshine? You think he's telling the truth? He doesn't strike me as the dishonest type. Yeah, that's my read too. First rule in this business is never go against your gut. So, if we take him at his word, the front door has mines, synths, and probably other fun and exciting prizes. So, we're going in through the escape tunnel. 
The donut shop has an escape tunnel? What? Doesn't everyone have an escape tunnel? Seriously, though? Thank God for that tunnel. If it weren't for that, there wouldn't be any railroad left. The tunnel has got to be easier than a frontal assault. Easier, but no cakewalk. You lead us there, pal. I got you covered. Okay. What the hell is it? Under the bridge? He thinks I can't just drop down there. Why would you put me in the very top of the... That is poor. Yeah, you guys aren't making that jump either. Okay, then we'll go back where we came from. Okay, we'll go on the ground. I was kind of hoping to get uh, some sort of a landmark here so I could fast travel. I wanted to fast travel back to the Pridwin, change this stupid light on my, my power armor, possibly drop off my power armor. Then as well, um, upgrade that laser rifle I got now that we're level 2 science because we're gonna be dealing with synths here and if we're dealing with synths then best bet is to use a laser weapon of some sort oh wow Kidding me? Really, Mongols? Come here. got the code cuz I don't got the code oh some power armor in there it's missing some pieces though last time I found a power armor it was at like the national defense something I took it out and I eventually got, I immediately got attacked by a sentry bot <laughs> I guess he did not like me taking it of crates for everyone. Yeah, I'll take 16 shotgun shells. You betcha. Kind of like my little wish for my final house. I think it's going to have like a panic room or something. 